His songs were described as mini operas, rock anthems that defined a career with multiple acts. Meatloaf shot to stardom in 1977 with his debut album, Bad Out of Hell. It would become one of the best-selling albums of all time, with hits like Paradise by the Dashboard Light and Two Out of Three Ain't Bad. Then in the 90s, he won a Grammy for his comeback hit, I'd Do Anything for Love, But I Won't Do That. Born Marvin Leah Day, Meatloaf turned his childhood nickname into his stage name. With a flair for the dramatic, he felt singing a song was like playing a character. You live it. It becomes your soul. And that's how I sing. Before finding fame in the music business, Meatloaf starred in both the screen and stage versions of the Rocky Horror Picture Show. <laughs> Reunited with the cast of the cult classic in 2015 on the film's 40th anniversary. Why do you think this movie has endured for so long? I think it was an extraordinary cast with extraordinary energy. He also appeared in Wayne's World, Spice World, and Fight Club. My name is Bob. Bob. Yep. Heaven can the statement from Meatloaf's family says the 74-year-old passed away with his wife and daughters by his side. They did not say how he died, but urged fans, don't ever stop rocking. Joe Fryer, NBC News. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.